Five-year-old Ukrainian Karina Andreko just received life-saving heart treatment in Israel. Karina was born with a defect inside her heart between the two atriums. And uh, this defect makes a lot of blood to shunt from the left side of the heart to the right and makes the right side of the heart big. Her mom, Irina Andreko, sought help from Israel's field hospital just three miles from their home near the Polish border. There, doctors diagnosed Karina with a congenital defect treatable with a procedure available in Israel, but not in Ukraine. That's when Save a Child's Heart stepped in. We immediately said that we'll be happy to help, and a very fast operation began to start uh, the logistics of bringing the girl from a war zone to Israel, issuing passports, entry permits, vaccinations, examinations, and within two weeks, she was brought to Israel. Based at the Wolfson Medical Center in Holon, Israel, Save a Child's Heart has saved the lives of more than 5,000 children from 59 countries since it started more than 25 years ago. For us at Save a Child's Heart, it doesn't matter where the child comes from. It could be a Ukrainian child, it could be a child from Gaza, it could be a child from Iraq, from Syria, from Africa. We are here to help them and to save their lives. According to Tamar Shapira from Save a Child's Heart, Karina has a twin back in Ukraine and the family lives in an area heavily damaged by the war. Mother's not working, the girls are not going to kindergarten, the father was recruited to fight with the forces of Ukraine and her condition is very bad. We are a country that underwent many wars and we are also raising our children in, in a war zone, in essence. So although we can relate to her anxiousness and stress because we know how she feels. We had missiles thrown on my house and my children like she had on hers, so we understand her. And my grandparents were refugees from Europe, so we can relate. But again, I think we are lucky and we felt that we need to, to help her all we can. I am happy that I came to Israel for my child to have an operation here. On the one hand, I'm very worried about her, but I think everything will be fine. Doctors say Karina's prognosis is good and she should have a completely normal life. Julie Stahl, CBN News, Jerusalem.